Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for August the 27th. Today marks the death in 1521 of Josquin de Prey, and while this isn't directly Tudor-related, the music of Josquin greatly influenced our Tudor composers. In the 16th century, he was the most famous composer of his age, yet after a century or so, his work drifted into obscurity and was only rediscovered in the 20th century. Because of this, very little is known about him. He wrote both sacred and secular music and all of the significant vocal forms of the period and instrumental music, including masses, motets, and chansons. He spent his early life in France. He was singing in a choir in Anjou in the 1570s. Then he moved to Italy, where he spent much of his adult life. Some people say he might have gone to Hungary because there's a potential mention of him in a church record there. So that's the thing. Very little is known about him. But he did come back to France when he was older. His reputation grew and grew after he died, and there were countless writings about him. But then, like I said, he kind of drifted into obscurity, and it's only been since the 1950s that his music has really been rediscovered and appreciated. So I would encourage you today to listen to some Josquin and be transported. That's your Tudor Minute. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast. And I also have a weekly radio show called the Tudor Music Hour, which you can check out at tutormusichour.com.